Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to try to make a pull-out spice rack. And uh, the reason is, is because I have a small kitchen and uh, space is pretty essential. So um, as you can see up here, I have one whole cabinet just for seasoning, spices, and things like that. So I'm taking up a lot of room right here. And I even had a bunch of stuff on top of the refrigerator that I threw over here. So here's kind of the plan. I have a little space over here, right in between the refrigerator and the door, but I have a problem. There's a light switch here too. So there's a few problems going on. I have to try to work out, but the goal is to make a spice rack that will kind of pull out and make the most of this small space. So let's see what we got. All right, so I've got the outer frame built and I, the measurements aren't really gonna matter too much to you. It's made to fit my area. So uh, I won't worry about that too much, but down here, what I did is I made this a little bit longer. This is the bottom of our uh, rack and I made it to where the wheels are gonna go under here. So they'll be slightly hidden. Let's say this is the front. They'll be slightly hidden, but they're a little bit long. So it keeps this off the floor and uh, I'll, I'll miss a, that door kick in there so that's the reason why I have this down here it's mainly just to hide that wheel and it's gonna look a little bit better so next thing I'm gonna do is start adding in my shelves so this is where we're at so far and for the spacing in between the shelves I just kind of took some of the seasonings and and measured them in here and kind of figured out uh, how much space do I want and after I did that I made a little wooden template so what I could do is I had this laying on the ground and I could nail this side in, slide it over to here, put it in there, nail the sides also there. And I did the exact same thing when I dropped it down for this shelf here. Okay, so to hold in our small jars, I'm gonna use dowels on both sides. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna just drill a hole here and there and insert the dowel. Um, what I've done is I made a little template. So I hold it up against here, drill in here, spin it around, drill in there, and then just do the same thing to every side. So it's made my marks and I'll just drill in. Doing like that. All right, so I've got this flipped upside down now and I've added my little caster wheels. I just put two on here and these are not the plastic. These are kind of like a little bit of a rubber so it shouldn't scuff up the floor or anything like that. And here I've put these two pieces. I've screwed those together and then I screwed them to the wall. Same one down there, and this is where our sliders are gonna go. One here, and one down there. And here's with our sliders in place.
Guys, that is it for the video. I appreciate you guys watching. Don't forget to like, don't forget to subscribe, and hopefully this little project helps you in your efforts to build a slide out pantry or a slide out spice rack. See you guys on the next one. So what do you do when you have the day off? I built a spice rack that pulls out. What? Nice.